According to an article in Le Monde dated July 5, 2023, France has begun modernizing its Leclerc tanks to XLR standard, a project being carried out at KNDS Rouen facility. The first two XLRs were delivered in June, and the army is due to receive a first batch of 18 operational tanks in 2023. The overall plan is to upgrade 200 of the 215 Leclerc tanks currently in service with the French Army to XLR standard by 2029. This modernization initiative aims to enhance the capabilities of the Leclerc tank and integrate it into the Scorpion program. As part of the program, a new combat and information system known as the Scorpion Information and Command System SICS, will be incorporated. This will enable the Leclerc XLR to establish connectivity with other Scorpion vehicles like the Griffin, Jaguar, and Serval, resulting in a unified communications and battlefield management system. The Leclerc XLR is equipped with the Contact Tactical Radio System, and shares a common electronic system with other Scorpion vehicles. It benefits from an open electronic architecture, providing flexibility for future upgrades. Additionally, it is equipped with an NBC protection system, and night vision equipment to enhance its capabilities in various operational environments. One significant aspect of the upgrade involves integrating a new armor package. The Leclerc XLR incorporates additional modular armor on both the hull and the turret, thereby improving overall protection. The front part of the hull side is protected by thick passive armor, while the rear section features wire cage armor to defend the engine compartment against RPG attacks. The rear part of the hull is also equipped with wire cage armor for additional protection. Regarding crew safety, a notable change has been made to enhance survivability. The driver shell magazine, which previously stored 18 cannon shells, has been completely removed. This eliminates the risk of ammunition detonation in close proximity to the crew compartment. However, this change reduces the ammunition capacity, with only 22 rounds remaining in the autoloader magazine located in the turret's rear niche. The Leclerc XLR's protective and offensive capabilities have been significantly enhanced. It now offers improved protection against mines and rockets, and it includes a remotely operated 7.62mm weapon station designed specifically for urban combat. Furthermore, a new fire control system has been developed, enabling the tank to fire programmable ammunition for enhanced precision and effectiveness. While the modernization efforts have been well received, some concerns have been raised by observers. One issue is the considerable increase in the tank's weight. The previous version of the Leclerc, known as S3 or SXXI, weighed approximately 57. For tons, whereas the transformed Leclerc XLR is expected to weigh around 63 tons. This weight increase has raised concerns about the potential limitations it may pose for further technological development. The Leclerc, a French main battle tank, was designed to replace the AMX-30. Developed during the 1980s, the initial batch of Leclerc tanks was delivered to the French army in 1991. It features modular composite armor, a 120mm smoothbore gun, and advanced technology. With a V8 diesel engine, it can reach speeds of up to 70 km per hour on roads and 45 km per hour off-road. The Leclerc has seen combat in conflicts such as Operation Desert Storm and is highly regarded for its firepower, mobility, and modern design. It is currently in service in France, the United Arab Emirates, and Jordan.